there's an amendment that's being circulated uh, that is being spearheaded by Congressman Tom MacArthur of New Jersey that would offer some protections that are favored by moderates to uh, include coverage for patients with pre-existing conditions as well as consumers up to the age of 26, as well as some uh, proposals that would appease members of the Freedom Caucus, notably some waivers for states on those essential health benefits. I spoke to a Freedom Caucus source about exactly what these changes would do for that caucus, and I was told that the changes in this memo, if they are incorporated into the bill text, would secure 18 to 20 new yeses from Freedom Caucus members. That would bring the overall vote count for the Freedom Caucus to between 25 and 30 members of the Freedom Caucus. There would still be some holdouts that are called hell no's within the caucus, uh, but that is a significant number, 18 to 20 new yeses. The president had said that they were about 10 to 15 votes away from clearing the House when it was previously put forth at the end of March. The question is how the moderates feel about this and whether they would give away net votes to offset that. So we're still waiting for a comment from Congressman MacArthur's office about where the moderates stand on this. But there appears to be significant movement, Carl, on behalf of the Freedom Caucus. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.